been put under a, a microscope. Does that get frustrating for you guys that yeah. as much as it gets talked about and it can't get fixed? Yeah, I mean, you know, we try to try to get it going as much as we can, you know, just like sometimes just don't start to click for us, you know, but we just got to keep going and just keep cl cl cleaning up the little things and we'll hopefully work in our favor this week. What's the move been like around the team? I imagine this team hasn't lost 48 to nothing in a really yeah, long time. I mean, that. yeah, you know, people, you know, probably, you know, they're, Latin, they're sad probably, you know, we just got to move past, can't dwell on the misery, just got to keep our head up and just keep keep moving on, just keep working. So, next game. But every, the move overall has been pretty good. Everybody, you know, getting back in mode, just feeling good. Have you ever been involved in a, in a loss like that, even go back to JUCO, high school, anything uh, like that? I ain't going to lie, no. But, I mean, it, it happens, you know. It happens for a reason. So, just got to keep it, keep moving on, you know. But it's football. That's what happens. And, uh, you know, just talking specifically about Kansas, uh, mm -hmm. I mean, does this feel like maybe it would be a right game for, for the whole offense? Yeah, most definitely. Uh, you know, uh, this week, KU, they got a good, pretty uh, defense, pretty good team. I uh, feel like we will be able to get the ball moving, moving on the field. As long as we do our 111 and just do our, fix the little mistakes that we had last week, then just we'll, we'll most definitely, they'll be a good game for sure. So we just got to raise our level, like I said. When you're in an offense that is designed to go fast, designed to throw the ball a lot, and then you have to go be physical, be run block. Is that kind of those two things kind of go against each other for an, an offensive lineman? I mean, sometimes? yeah, I know. Yeah, just being a fat guy, I mean, you got to be able to move. You got to be able to do it, do it all. Cause I mean, you know, Coach Dunn, he he got his how the way he set up his scheme. You know, just got to be able to just stay stay on track with him and just keep up. But I mean, it's, it's hard, but you just gotta just gotta be on it. That's all. Is it a little bit weird? getting your butt whooped in Kansas and having to go back to that state again? I mean, yeah, I mean, it is what it is. I mean, shoot, yeah, I mean, it was my first time out there, so it was a it was a learning experience, but, you know, now I just got to can't keep thinking about it and just move on to the next one, you know, get this dub this week and just celebrate and just keep on going forward from there, so. I and mean, does it feel like your guys' team goals are still kind of intact at yeah, this point? Yeah, most or? definitely from last year, you know, coming up short in Big 12, you know, I feel like, you know, that's my main goal for sure, just getting to that Big 12 championship again. You know, I hope, hopefully that's everybody else's goal as well. So, most definitely. Is that just, you know, I mean, to get there, you're probably going to have to win out now. At this right, point, yeah, we, we're going to have to most definitely win out, just win every game from now on. So, I can't, can't lose anymore. Thank you. For more information, you can visit TulsaWorld.com.